We made the first video in Baghdad. I spent two weeks here doing completely ordinary things. I met the locals and I learned Arabic language. I also took this beautiful sunset shot here on the Tigris River. I then took a local bus north to the city of Samara. This place is incredible, 50 meters tall and it was built in the 9th century. They call Masjid Malviya, <laughs> unbelievable. Yes, needless to say, I'm very disappointed. Until a few weeks ago you could go to the top, but then something happened. The park was closed for renovations, but that's only half the reason. Work hasn't even started yet, but the reason for the early closure is that some idiot tourist took a selfie and fell down the stairs. As I'm still learning Arabic, it wasn't clear from what height the tourist fell. From there I went back to Baghdad from where I continued south to the city of Babylon. I have already shared a video of Saddam Hussein's palace here. You can click here if you want to watch the video about Saddam Hussein's palace. The renovated ancient city of Babylon. The original ruins are 4,300 years old. and the famous statue of the lion in Babylon. It is said to be the oldest lion statue in human history. It is more than 3,600 years old. I spent one week in the city of Babylon and then went on the southern city of Nasiriya where I visited the ruins of Ziggurat of Ur. So this is the ziggurat of Ur? Yeah, uh -huh. all the city Ur. Uh, this one, uh, royal palace. This city is three civilization. First one, 4000 BC. Second one, 2900 BC. Third one, 2113 BC. This is the oldest one, right? Uh, same time. It's all of them the same uh, this time? Same time, third one, 2113 uh -huh. BC. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Now about 4000 years ago. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you. Well, thank you. Well, thank you. <laughs> yes, there was no fence here a few months ago, and you could go to the top. Guess what happened? My guide said someone took a selfie here and rolled down the stairs. Familiar story, right? 
sooner or later, wherever the tourist sets foot, this happens. The government wanted to protect this ruin, but now they decided to close it for good. You can only see the ruins from the outside. You never can go to the top again. I arrived in Nasiriya, where I stayed for a week, and headed for my destination, the mysterious Iraqi marshes, which will be another video.